Hello guys, welcome back to my channel VFX Expert. So guys, in this today's class, we are going to see important Nuke notes which every paint artist should know. So now we are inside Nuke here and this is our plate here and suppose uh, just we want to remove this character from this sort here. So first category just we need actually these two notes here which is our actually this denoise and reduce noise note here because first when we will start any work in paint so first we have to create a degreen plate or denoise plate so for this we need these two notes here so this is actually denoise and this reduce noise so this reduce noise actually just a plugin so this is actually add-on plugins and this is inbuilt new node here so using these two nodes just we can create our degreen plate or denoise plate here then after creating your degreen plate we have to create a clean plate so for creating a clean plate we need actually mainly this roto paint node and also this frame hold node even if you want you can also create your clean plate outside from this nuke like uh, using silhouette effects or photoshop then after this you have to import clean plate inside nuke but using this roto paint mode you can also just create a clean plate and with the help of this frame mode just we can hold our frame on we just type created our clean plate here and then after this we need actually this roto node so roto is the main important nodes inside nuke here so with the help of this roto node just we have to create our shape according to requirement then this copy road just we can copy our alpha channels from this roto shapes or from mat and this pre melt this blur and this edge blur so using these two nodes just we can actually smooth your shape edge edge so now just i am going to first explain all these nodes here using one example here so, so again same this is our actually original plate then after this just i have created over this d green plate using this reduce noise node then we have to write out from this new key then after this we have to import over this D green plate inside nuke if you want to create a clean plate inside nuke or you can also import this D green plate inside silhouette effects so this is totally depends on you okay then after this just we have to create a clean plate so again suppose at last frame maybe i think just type created about so this is actually a D green plate and this is our auto paint node so just type use maybe multiple auto nodes here and this is actually uh, just output after removing this area so in our upcoming classes we will completely remove this character from this scene yes but this is just only for explanations okay so now if you will see so just simply just i have removed uh, this character from this area only then after this what we have to do so just we have to create a root shape because uh, from this portion just we have to remove this uh, character okay so like this you can also uh, remove this character from your entire sort here so later we will explain all these things here then after this what i have done so if you will see so suppose this is actually clean plate so now if you will uh, move this plate so again just i am getting this uh, character here because uh, if you are using maybe this roto pad node so you have to also select your all press and just you have to use live as a all frames here but rather than using this option just simply just we can use this frame hold so now so suppose just type created about add frame maybe 1153 so here just type use this frame hold so now if you will see so in all frames just i am getting this still frames here okay then after this just type created about this roto so because from this area only just we have to remove then this copy node and this primal so now just i am getting this thing here then after this just we have to merge this portion on top of our this d grain plate here so simply if you will see or just disable all these nodes usually just we can understand now press d here so just we will explain all these things here so now just i am getting this result here okay so now go to at last because at last frame just i have created this clean pad so i am getting this result here okay so you can see so again this is actually just original plate or, or original d green plate and this is our output here so you can see this one here so only from this area just i have removed this character here so so now after this just we need actually this grade node and a color corrections node here so if there is any required maybe for color correction for matching or clean plate with your plate so we need this maybe a grade node even color correction node and this is also a defocus node for matching a defocus here then after this uh, just uh, suppose if there is any motion in your sort so if you will check so again this is our actual plate here so this is actually a, a moving plate here so you can see so camera is moving so if you are a moving plate 
then we need all these tracker nodes and we will calculate the motion of the plate and we will match our clean plate with our original plate first node whichever this 2d tracker or normal tracker node then camera tracker and this smart vector so with the help of this 2d tracker we can track the 2d motion of the plate then with the help of this camera tracker just we can track the camera motion and with the help of this smart vector we can capture deformations motions like uh, suppose maybe a uh, shirt or face even you can also use actually planar tracker node but uh, mainly these uh, nodes are important here okay so now just i've tracked about this sort using this tracker so simply just you can see these actually two uh, just track one just i've tracked for this sort then after this if you will see so just i applied yes so now if you will again check this one here so go to this last so now just i generated a, just a tracking data from our this tracker and just i am getting this node which is our this tracker node here so simply just select this one and press d so now if you will see so this plate is just moving according to our this original plate movement here so now you can see here so in all frame this is just matching here but if you will see in some places this is not properly matching here. so just you can see this area here so suppose if this uh, clean plate is not matching in all frame then manually we have to match in all frame so for this we need actually these three nodes here which i will transform so with the help of this transform just we can match maybe rotation positions even scales then corner pin with the help of this corner pin just we can match our perspective and with the help of grid walk just we can also match over this inside area these three nodes are very important for a paint prep artist if you are matching your clean pit with your original plates here okay so now just i'm going to show you here again in this example so here just i've used over this corner pin so now if you will enable this value so you will get this result here okay so now if you will see this is just matching here okay so this actually totally depends uh, on your sort requirement maybe just we have to use maybe this one or this one or this one or all these three nodes just we need for matching this plate here all things just we will explain in our upcoming classes how we can use all the node and just simply just we can achieve our required work here then after this we need a motion by 2d node or motion by 3d node and this vector blast so with the help of each node just we will match our motion bar so these nodes actually just only for matching motion bar if there is any actually too much motion bar in your sort then you have to match clean plate motion bar with your original plate so using these nodes just we have to match motion bar uh, if you want to support reveal this character then you can also use in node so now if you will press tab so you will get actually in node so Okay, in even if you will use merge then you will also get in operation inside merge node so this in node is also important nodes here then this merge node so this is common node so in all steps just we need this merge node here then reformat and this is actually another node which is this difference node so this is also important nodes here then these two nodes here so after completing all these steps finally we have to reapply our crane on our final composting so for this we need actually this f grain or we can also use this task grain node so this is again add-on nodes so for this just you have to simply you can take this node from uh, nukepeter.com and just simply just you can use inside nuke and this is nuke uh, maybe inbuilt node so with the help of these two nodes just we, we have to reapply grain on our final composting and just we have to match with our original plate here so guys, these are actually main important nodes uh, which every paint artist should know. Even some other nodes are there, but uh, mainly actually these nodes are very important for every paint artist. So guys, till here I've completed about this class, and in upcoming classes we will explain how to use all these nodes inside Nuke. So guys, if you like this video, please watch, share, comment, and subscribe my channel if you are still not subscribed my channel. So thanks for watching.